Okay, we've got another video here for you guys today, and um, I also want to show off the new pavers in my backyard. The landscaper is about three weeks to get this done, but I paved the front of the greenhouse, the back of the backyard, put in some new walkways here, nice pathway along the uh, fruit trees, and um, check that out. So no more, no more dealing with stupid grass, um, especially my grass. <laughs> it kind of looked like crap. Um, the only thing that uh, I had to sacrifice was the fact that <clears throat> the landscapers ate a lot of my fig bribas that were on the tree. You know, I was a little saddened by the fact that they ate some figs that um, have never ripened for me before. So, um, but it is what it is. I have to wait another year and uh, I'm okay with that. Anyhow, for today's video, I have a Grantham's Royal. Or, yep, there it is. Now this tree here, I think is about three to four years old. It's not the best looking tree. Um, it's kind of growing sideways on me. So when I repot this or put this in the ground, I'll probably stand it straight up. I've got a few Brebas on here that are ripe. And let's pick these. Now these look a lot different from the one that I had uh, the year previous. The one in the, from last year was a lot bigger than this. And it was um, big and long. This is a little bit different maybe because it ripened outside. And uh, <clears throat> I left it out all winter long. And so perhaps the one from last year was in the greenhouse. You know, it, it grew a little, little bit differently because it wasn't exposed to the outdoors. Anyhow, let's, let's pick a fig here. Let's pick up this leaf. That way you can see what that looks like. Put it on our plate. Right, so here's the Grantham's Royal, aka also known as Dauphine. Now this trip will produce uh, three Brebas on three branches. That's uh, not super productive, but that's okay. Um, it's a very good tasting Breba. Let's cut this guy open, shall we? Okay, weight test. 42 grams, not so bad. That's about an average fig. Yeah, I'd say average is closer to 50. So the air quality, pretty much all of the West Coast has been terrible the last couple of weeks because of all the, the fires that are happening around um, California and Eastern Washington. So I'm gonna try to make this video quick. They say that being outdoors for an entire day in this weather or in this smoke is like smoking seven to eight cigarettes a day so i probably already smoked at least two all right so let's try this thing out shall we grantham's royal aka delphine oh yeah that's good hmm It's not super sweet, but it hits the uh, kind of the average point for me as far as sweetness goes. Mmm. Juicy. A little bit of seed crunch. And, uh, I don't know, it, it doesn't taste like strawberry. It has more of a... A melony tone to it, but very good. I mean, Grantham's Royal is a is a good fig to have, especially here since you know this tree was left outdoors all winter long, still came back in a pot, didn't die off, and produced tasty Brebas. Let's put the score up on the board. All right, guys. Well, don't forget to subscribe fig tasting videos to come. I've got a lot of figs here that are producing for me that I haven't produced uh, in the years previous. 
and uh, I'm looking forward to doing more of those videos on the main crop that is coming up. So please subscribe uh, and don't forget to like the video. Thanks you guys. I'll see you next time.